vlog I'm so happy you clicked on it so today is a vlogmas day 16 oh my god we are almost at Christmas did you guys enjoy my Christmas tag yesterday I really enjoyed talking about just the holiday period so in light of that I'm getting ready to go to H-E-B to and I'm taking you guys with me so my husband said that he wanted some Cajun Alfredo. So I'm making that tonight. Chicken and shrimp. I already got my water boiling. I need to get noodles. Um, I got my sauce started. I roasted some garlic earlier. Ugh, the house just smells like straight garlic. Um, so yeah, I have the chicken. Chicken thighs already cut up and seasoned. They're kind of just like marinating or whatever. So I have a couple things I want to get to make this holiday drink. We're going to have the pasta and then we're going to have the drink, a holiday drink. So it's going to require cranberries, cranberry juice, rosemary sprigs, which I already have, and limes. So I really only need a couple of things, but I want to take you guys with me because it's literally like right up the street. And I'm actually holding the camera because I'm driving my red car and I really don't have anywhere to put the camera. So yeah, it's 5.39. I just logged off of work. Work was so stinking busy today. I look a mess. Like I haven't even showered all day today. Um, that's just how it is sometimes. Um, yeah, so to H-E-B we go. H-E-B is literally like a mile away from my house. How awesome is that? Oh, and I did want to get some different pampers because we're using the Honest Pampers. And I really, I, I think they're just so hard. Like, they're not soft and, like, cushiony. So, I'm going to get him probably a pack of pampers as well. So, yeah, let's go. I literally should have done a curbside order. But even when I do curbside, I end up going in. So... Here we are. I'm gonna be in and out because I'm literally in the middle of cooking. like H-E-B. Five dollars off your basket when you buy thirty dollars of pampers, diapers, or wipes. So we're still trying to figure out which ones we really like. I like the pamper swallows. He remembers the Huggy special delivery. So I'm going to get a small one of each so we can really pay attention to and confirm which ones we like.
well as the other one with the mashed potatoes and the stuffing right here as well. So that's chicken and you guys have the butter in there. Oh yeah, turkey with the stuffing and mashed potatoes. And then we have the turkey with the sweet potatoes and the green beans. And I know it says 17 minutes. I recommend doing 20. Just okay, to make sure that the turkey co like cooks all the way through. Oh my god, I want to try it. It's okay, so good. I'm get it's so good. Yeah, go for it. So y'all, I'm on the way to check out. And I literally got almost everything that I came in here for and some. No, I literally got everything else off of the list. Like, I didn't even get the noodles. That's the main thing that I need. What is wrong with me? When I get up in HEB, I get so damn distracted. These are the things that I had ordered the other day that didn't come. Remember I told you guys I had ordered these little snack trays? And they didn't come, so I'm gonna get two. Look y'all, one of my antlers already done came off. Ain't that some shit? Anyway, so $77 later, all this stuff. I did get some Pampers though. Be a good Samaritan and put the freaking cart back. Okay, y'all, so I got the Alfredo sauce warming up. Got the this is butter, heavy cream, and Parmesan cheese. The noodles are boiling. And I'm getting ready to start on the chicken. Here is the roasted garlic. This is tonight's wine, a conundrum. And y'all, I totally forgot that we had these main lobster ravioli from Costco. It came in like a two pack. I have made one pack before, but these things bustin'. So after these noodles are like all the way done, I'm going to swap out the water and cook the ravioli too. The chicken is getting there done. When it's done, I'll transfer it to this pan and then it's gonna go in the oven. All right, so I'm just gonna put down using the same pan. Put all this garlic in there and butter. Prepping for the shrimp. The noodles are done. The sauce is done. The chicken is in the pan already. I'm gonna add the noodles and the sauce and the shrimp and mix it all up. And it's gonna go in the oven on 350. Y'all won't believe what I just did too. So. <laughs> I had rinsed the shrimp off, patted them dry, and began seasoning them. And I thought that this was lemon pepper, but it's buttery cinnamon roll that I poured all over the damn shrimp. So I had to rinse them off and start again. Here is the lemon and garlic. Shrimp is in the pan. I got some fresh garlic. Product. 
Okay, you guys, now it's time for us to make our holiday mistletoe margarita. So you'll need some lemon juice, some fresh cranberries, fresh lime, lime juice squeezed here, two nice glasses, whatever glasses you wanna use. I have sugar here for the rim, or you can use salt, whatever your preference is. Rosemary, fresh rosemary. Topo Chico, I'm using the hint of a lime. Topo Chico. Topo Chico, <laughs> Topo Chico, and light cranberry juice. Or if you wanna have the full cocktail juice, it's up to you, boo. Do you, boo. Now that we have all our ingredients, we're gonna start by juicing our rim with some fresh lime. And you're going to add either sugar or salt to the rim, whatever your preference is. Make sure that you add the product on both sides of the rim and that it's coated evenly. As you can see, the sugar is evenly coated all throughout the glass on the inside and outside. We're gonna be using Lalo Tequila. My husband picked this up at the local uh, twin liquor, liquor store and they said that it was Don Julio's brother. <laughs> so uh, again, here are all the ingredients and don't forget your fresh rosemary. So you're gonna take your tequila and you're going to pour about an ounce or two ounces, whatever you're feeling like, girl, pour it up, pour it up. Then you're gonna get your ice cubes and you're gonna go ahead and put your ice cubes in your glass and pour your tequila right over the ice. I'm using light cranberry juice, but you're just gonna fill it up. Really no measurements, just do it until your heart is content, boo. Now you're gonna add your fresh squeezed lime. I used about three limes. They weren't super juicy, so I had to use three and it didn't render a lot of lime juice. But we're gonna go over it with this Topo Chico with a hint of lime. So that's gonna give it that little extra spunk that it needs. So after we've topped our drinks off, we're gonna add some fresh cranberries. They can be found in the produce section at your local grocery store. And you're just gonna add as many until your heart is content. And then we're gonna add our fresh rosemary sprigs. They really add that Christmassy touch, holiday touch to any type of drink. And so I'm just going to stir all of these ingredients together underneath the ice so I don't mess up the drink. And there you guys have it. This is your tequila mistletoe margarita. food looks so good y'all just saw the close-up I'm getting ready to eat but I wanted to taste this holiday Christmas mistletoe margarita made with te tequila on camera with you guys it looks so good mm. babe you gotta try this oh my god it tastes so good and I can't really taste the tequila at all God, I love this. I can't really taste the rosemary. They're pretty much just there for garnish. The cranberries make it look so freaking pretty. And then that block ice looks so good. Ugh. Cheers. Happy Vlogmas Day 16. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.